What's going on you guys, this is MaxKD, I have another Dell Optiplex, this is the mini tower, we're going to be a process upgrade, show you how to do that. So we move the side cover panel. Now you can use a Phillips screwdriver, and you're going to move the two screws here in the bottom and two in the top. I'm going to zoom in the camera. And you disconnect the CPU fan from the motherboard. And guys, this upgrade will work with the Dell Optiplex 390, 790, 3010, 3020, 7020, and the 9020 for the mini tower. So here's a new processor, and all you're gonna do is take a paper towel and you're gonna wipe down the old thermal compound. Same with the heat sink, do that, I'm just gonna wipe it off. Now I'm gonna take the rubbing alcohol. I would go with minimum, minimum 70% rubbing alcohol. You can buy any, uh, any store, they sell it usually in grocery store, any other store like at the pharmacy area, you can get this. 70% work really well or you can go with uh, 91% that works even better, but most stores don't sell this, but you can get it if you But this works a lot better So I'm gonna apply that the rubbing alcohol to the napkin And that's good enough. Now I'm gonna go ahead and remove the processor. So a pan right here is like this. Lift straight up like this. Now I'm gonna install the new one. Now I'm going to take the thermal compound, the way you guys can do it this way, you can take the thermal compound and apply it right here in the middle. Write them out then, will, when you install the heat sink back, it will spread evenly. But uh, the best thermal compound guys I like is our uh, Arctic Civil 5, Arctic MX2 or the MX4, this is the best they have. So I'm just going to go this way, show you the other way. I'm going to apply in the middle, then I'm going to take this little and just spread it evenly like this. And that's good enough. Now we're gonna take that back the four pin for the CPU fan, connect it back to the motherboard. Make sure you go around the bottom ones, the top one, make sure they're tight, they're not loose, the screws. And you're done. 
So you guys, it's the end of the video. Now you're gonna close the side cover panel. Thanks for watching. Bye.